caring for your parents or an older adult in your families always seems to be a concern. Mm -hmm. And sometimes there's a way to make sure people who are living in that senior citizen part of their lives that they're able to be independent and stay yeah. connected to everything they want to do. Now Susan Ryan is the Lifeline Coordinator from Mother Francis Hospital and joins us this morning. Thanks for stopping by sure. Susan. Okay so tell us you know many individuals they're homebound and they have parents or relatives mm -hmm. who may be elderly and mm -hmm. sick and they mm -hmm. worry about them Correct. if they were to fall go into cardiac arrest but you guys mm -hmm. have a program that can help with that. Yes it's called Lifeline and this is what it looks like. This is a little button and you can wear it around your wrist or your neck you need help you press this button one time and we come in through the little speaker box and we talk to you and ask how we can help okay. we do whatever you ask call the ambulance call my daughter whatever wow okay. and how often do you get uh, calls with this service you know oh, daily you really okay and each time this uh, button the button is pressed I get a fax okay. that tells me what's up and what happens and that goes into my client's file, and the doctor also gets a copy of that fax. Now, is it avail is the service available 24 hours a day? 24 hours a day. Uh -huh. This is a national company, mm -hmm. and our speakers are um, at a call center, and so they're always there, always available. So mm -hmm. if somebody cannot respond to mm -hmm. um, We ask device. them twice if they need help. If they don't answer after the second time, we break the connection and we start getting help for them. The first thing we're going to do is call a neighbor or relative that says they could check on them. And if they're not available, we get um, emergency help. Okay. Wow. And I mean, I'm sure you have plenty of stories out there of things that could have gone in, in a very dangerous direction oh, yes. and then maybe been prevented because even though someone's mm -hmm. not home, there's that peace of mind. Yeah. Yes. You know, I think it would also provide as Gloria is kind of talking mm -hmm. to, not just comfort mm -hmm. for that person that would mm -hmm. be that would be using the lifeline, but also the family members to know that if something were to happen, mm -hmm. you know, a grandmother who's living at home mm -hmm. by herself, if something were to happen, they can have that peace of mind too. I have a lot of families who uh, are out of town mm -hmm. and their, their parents are here right. and it, it helps them to know. You know how difficult it is to sign up for a service like this? Uh, very easy. They just need to call me. My number is 903-531-5144 and we talk over the phone, we set up the appointment and then we go to the client's home and okay. set the machinery up, make sure they're comfortable with it. Can you give us a quick estimate on the price? It's $40 a month. Mm -hmm. There's no installation fee at this time and the contract is month to month. Great. All well, right. Susan from Trinity Mother Francis, the number is up on your screen. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, you. Susan. Well, another Sarah Palin. Francis, the number is up on your screen. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. Well, another Sarah. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. Well, another Sarah. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. Well, another Sarah. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. Well, another Sarah. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. Well, another Sarah. Mm -hmm. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank a lot, Palin. But you. Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks Thank
Thanks, Thank Mark Palin, but Susan. One other Sarah. Thanks, 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 Mark Palin, but Susan.